Yeah, because guess what? He's been spying on her. Yeah. To find an in. To find an in to the <laughs> open door. He says, I don't want to go in what every other thief is doing. Yeah. I want to find Well, he side. thinks it's a trap. Yes, he does. He's a fool. <laughs> <laughs> a real idiot. <laughs> Musical Monday! Musical Monday! This story needs to be seen to be believed. Never get stolen by a spy thief. Musical Monday! Ooh! And welcome back to Musical Monday with Zach and Shay at Improv Broadway. I'm Zach. I'm Shay. And joined with us, well, we're also at Improv Broadway, but joined with us is the man who stole my heart, Caleb Wall on the Keys. Where is it? Where? Where'd you put it? Tell me where you put Thief. it. Thief! Thief! Where'd yeah. you put it? He put it in a shirt. I'll never go in there. I'm a prude. <laughs> Come on, touch him. Come on. Touch him. He likes it. <laughs> yeah. Can you feel him pulsing <laughs> from my ear? Expectations were higher in my head. But what has perfectly met my expectations is today's musical, The Spy Who Thieved. Not all spies are thieves, and not all thieves are spies. But all spies are thieves, <laughs> oh, well. and thieves are spies. <laughs> so let's combine all that together. Not <laughs> all, all spies, spies are thieves, thieves and, and not, not all thieves, thieves are spies, spies but, but all, all spies, spies are thieves, thieves and, and thieves, thieves are spies. spies. A riddle and enigma <laughs> for you to unravel, my dear. Because if there's one thing that I know is true, is that... Everything is both true and false at the same time. Everything's a paradox, and nothing is. Yeah. For instance, the people I love the most, I also hate the most. <laughs> Good to know. And the place where I sweep, sleep the most, the place I'm always awake. <laughs> and the place that I poop the most is also the place I poop the least. And the, and the air that I breathe is also the breathe that I air. So that's the... The writer's foreword about, uh, <laughs> about the script. Those are the only notes from the director. This musical is all about pickpockets, thieving, spies. Sleuths. Sleuths. Miss, mismatchers. Heists. All the sneaky snooks. Sneaky snooks. Sneakery snickeries. We open up good old England, land of the pickpockets, and home of the museum. The British Museum. The British Museum of Pockets. Of Pockets. Every thieves dream. The jackpot. Imagine <laughs> picking every pocket in the British Museum of Pockets. Our main character asks themselves, whose name is... Snitch. Snitch. Snitch McGrabums. <laughs> he was born to be a thief. Snitch McGrabums is a real snitch. <laughs> and he's always telling on other people that thief, but he never tells on himself. He wants to be the only thief in town. He does. So yeah. He keeps getting the other guys caught. But so he doesn't thief just to have money. No. He thieves because it makes him feel good to have other people's stuff. Yeah. He doesn't just steal for his own personal gain. He also steals for his self-esteem. <laughs> yeah. Wearing a Gucci bag. Yoink. Now I feel good. And it makes him feel close to all the people who steals from. That's why he tries to steal from good people. Like his family. Like his family. And Abraham Lincoln. Who came to visit England. He robbed his grave. <laughs> his his body came to visit England. And then he immediately They did like a funeral tour thing. It's yeah. Whole deal. Yeah, he stole the bullet from his brain. Yeah, and he put that in his pocket. And it made him feel good. And closer to Abraham. <laughs> <laughs> A real complicated character from the start. So in this song, he sings about all the different famous people that he's stolen from. And the timeline is ambiguous. <laughs> Anywhere from 800 BC to 2020. <laughs> Because this, you can steal from graves. Yeah. In fact, he does a lot. He does. That's his main he thing. He wants to feel close to dead people. And who is he spying for? Well, you're about to find out. <laughs> That's another layer I forgot about. <laughs> In this song called... Well, he's not spying on anyone. That's the secret. Oh, I just spoiled, spoiled it. <laughs> um, In this song called... Mm, celebrity Thief. <laughs> Anyone 
one can steal a diamond or a string of pearls. Anyone can snatch a purse from a little girl's. But every thief thinks that there's a specific way to behave. But this old thief, oh, what I want most, oh, it's in the grave. You know Margaret Thatcher, I snatched her. You know George Washington, I got him. I got him all right here in my piggity 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 pocket. You know little Jack Horner. You know the little boy on the corner. I stole his story and said I wrote it by myself. If you make lots of money or are famous, I'm gonna give you lots of grief. If you're poor, I don't mind. You ain't got nothing to worry about me. Because I only put my little grubby tiny little fingers in the pockets of celebrities. You know, Queen Elizabeth, you know the one. I won't name her number. But after I stole this thing from her itty bitty grave, all the family felt so much dumber. Because I stole the family jewels, but not the ones that are locked in the Tower of London. I stole her jewels, there were her teeth and her hair after I was done. But I felt so close to her, rubbing her hair and her teeth upon my cheek. I felt that I understood what she went through and I felt she understood me. That my secret desire is not to be a thief, it's to be an international spy. If that is something that I could do, this old assembly thief would die. I'm a suburb thief who wants to be a spy. I'm a suburb thief who really wants to be a spy. I'm a suburb thief who wants to be a little spy. But in the meantime, I'll steal from the graves of celebrities a dooby doobity doo. Wow! Also, I'm British. <laughs> But so, he sings in an American jazzy accent. That's the that's the secret to being a thief. You yeah. ha- have secret identities always. Swish swash swoosh. <laughs> swish swash swoosh. Over here, I'm a uh, I'm a jazz singer guy with simple rhymes. Yeah. And now the A, I'm a British snitch McGrabbum. And he's always eating buffalo wings and watching football because that's what he thinks Americans do. He's yes. not wrong. He's not wrong, but he's always watching the game while he's trying to steal a plasma TV. He's always loading and <laughs> unloading a 22. People come out of their homes and they're like, why is there so much buffalo chicken sauce over here? Why is every day a tailgate party? There's no game going on. Why is there ranch inside of my jewel purse? <laughs> <laughs> ranch. Because <laughs> he dips his chicken he wings. He dips his chicken memes in the jewel purse but one day he comes across a girl who is basically asking to be stolen from asking i mean just Begging. look at her door it's wide open she leaves it open when she goes out and she leaves a trail of a hundred dollar bills up into the house <laughs> she just trusts people so much and she thinks that she's never gonna get thieved never she's cocky yeah arrogant disgusting unkissable <laughs> ugly <laughs> <laughs> that's that is written in the script but the actress that plays her yeah, yeah. gorgeous 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 and so the audience has a hard time because she's smoking hot. Some would say kissable ugly. Yeah. Kissable beautiful. Not unkissable <laughs> ugly. Kissable ugly. <laughs> not ugly enough to not be kissable. See, she, this, this person is every, um, every thief's dream because yeah. she's so gullible. Yeah. She's, you could just say, hey, I, the parliament sent me and they told me to steal your bed. And she'd believe it. Well, trusting. Trusting. Yeah. And so... In this song, she explains why she does what she does. She dives in a little bit deeper of who she be and why she is. <laughs> Any other thoughts that you liked from this song? <laughs> I think let's discover it in the music. <laughs> okay. In this song, door wide open. 
Maybe if the thieves come at me Opens herself up like a lamb to the slaughter to be stolen. a philanthropist. She's a real philanthropist. She's Teresa, mother. She's Teresa, comma, mother. Teresa, comma, kid. Kid Teresa. Kid Teresa. They've known to call her on the streets because she's letting herself wide open that that she's making it such an easy target Mm -hmm. for the thieves that no one who shops at Target has been stolen, which is, and <laughs> and they're stealing from Target over eight hundred million dollars a year, <laughs> which yeah, well is they, fine. Which they is do fine. this thing where they'll they buy two pairs of shoes, and then yeah. they go back with they the put cheaper the cheaper shoes, shoes in the more expensive shoe box, it. and <laughs> they return <laughs> that and they get the refund for the more expensive shoes that they kept. Which is something you should never do. Careful, no, never, Caleb. never do that. Careful. They're watching. I'll you. turn you in. Civilians arrest. <laughs> Civilians arrest. I got cuffs in my purse. They offered us a fifty dollar uh, coupon to Target for anyone we turn in. <laughs> <laughs> and I need some shoes. And I need, yeah, and I need zip patches. So you Five guys, you guys did get a brand deal, and you didn't cut me in. <laughs> <laughs> we know you don't shop at Target. A, a, a You're ba- a Walmart man. Shut your mouth. <laughs> a back a backdoor Target plea deal. <laughs> We made a Come we made on. a plea deal with. <laughs> Keep us Show me your chest. Come on, Come target tattoo. Come on, target. Come on, bullseye. Target, please. Target. Come, Come on, on, little. Go me a boy. Come, Come me on, me I pull my shirt down. You give me a deal. Come, <laughs> Come on, target. <laughs> ooh, ooh, it's getting hot. Uh, and this um, this woman, her acts of selflessness are so heroic, and so selfless, and so philanthropic. They touch the thief spy's heart. Yeah, because guess what? He's been spying on her. Yeah. To find an in. To find an in to the open <laughs> door. He says, I don't want to go in what every other thief is doing. Yeah. I want to find Well, a he side. thinks it's a trap. Yes, he does. He's a fool. <laughs> <laughs> 
a real <laughs> idiot. And as he's trying to break in one night from the side, he sees her laying out her plans and realizes, oh my gosh, this wasn't a trap. She's just the most giving person in the whole world. Mm-hmm. And then he realizes that um, he doesn't uh, he doesn't necess- he doesn't want to be a thief anymore. He wants to be caught by her. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Wants to go to jail. <laughs> he wants the death penalty <laughs> <laughs> from her. From her for the he cloud. Wants- <laughs> for the cloud. He wants to die a legacy. He, he wants her she's- to flip the switch. <laughs> she's never turned in a thief. She's let herself been thieved thousands of times. And yeah. so what does she do? She takes the fall for his crimes, <laughs> and she's sentenced to the electric chair. Yes, and so in this song, she's dying, but the thief is going to take her place. And so they're arguing over why they should be the ones to die. (laughs) Yeah, they're arguing this to the judge, jury, and executioner right there about to flip the switch. Give him the chair! (laughs) And he says, give me the chair. And then she says, give me the chair. In this song, give Give me me the chair. chair. I can't let you do this. Yes, you can. You're too good of a person. I've been nothing but an old scobbly winks. Everyone in these sales are snitched and I put them in there. I'm giving you a chance to have a second chance. So technically a third chance. Well, I think you deserve a first chance because you haven't lived your own life. You 
have so much faith in the afterlife How do you know when they switch out? It goes night, it goes black in your eyes How do you have so much faith in the beyond? Give me the chair Give me I the don't chair care. I know I don't it care. doesn't seem How you know very it doesn't fair. seem very Give fair me Give me the chair Give me the chair me for it If I win then I deserve it Rock, paper, scissors me for it If I win then I deserve it Rock, paper, scissors Shoot! Gun! Oh. <laughs> well I guess I don't need the chair Cause you shot me right there Knife to the ribs Put us both out of our misery Put us both, both <laughs> in the chair You can fry us both Life isn't worth living Please put us out of our misery It is going dark <laughs> And I'm afraid The story of the afterlife was overplayed and there's no light and there's no light <laughs> I don't see a light in the distance I no see light Why is there why do I have the light in the distance? Oh no, I see flames coming down from above. I think I know where I gotta go. I see light. I see light. Only now I realize where I'm in the distance. I think I'm going to hell. I think you're going to heaven. We got the chair. fair at all I tried my all to redeem myself from going down to hell well let's see you later I guess I guess you can't have the chair the high chair that you missed when you were a baby I can see it now <laughs> in the distance that's right, dying turned me back into a baby. Reincarnation is real. <laughs> and I'm your dad. I think I am. And also I. I am your mom. I'm both your parents. Reincarnation is weird. It's all that I feared. And as your parents <laughs> learned this one lesson, being kind <laughs> is sure a blessing. Make sure you don't steal, don't be a thief. Make sure you always spy. <laughs> they were reincarnated, the thief into both parents and herself as herself as oh, a baby. Wow. Time's a flat circle. Wow, wow. You think the Phantom of the Opera has a twist? Think again. Think again. There's no twist in that musical, but there sure is in this one. There sure is in this one. And here's a twist we have for you. This episode's over. I know from those songs you thought they might go on forever, <laughs> but all good things must come to an end. But we will be reincarnated next week as a new musical. As a new musical <laughs> episode. And we hope that you're there, and we hope that you live a good life, and your chakras align with ours as you tune in every Monday here at... Musical Now, don't steal from mommy. She got this from you, Dennis. <laughs>